Okay guys, looking for a cheap camper van? Under 70,000. Here's a brand new 2023 Winnebago Solus. One of the smallest class B's on the market. Okay, I like this unit. As soon as you come in, you do have netting here for to keep the bugs out. I love the floor plan, okay? I almost bought one of these. You have your seating area here, which you could put a table. Uh, it does have the table there. It's on the ground. Or you can make this a separate sleeping area. Very functional layout. So you have your seating area, and then you have your bed area. So you don't have to make your bed every day. You can leave your bed like that, put your sheets and your covers, and then use this as your workspace. Has the built-in blackout shades. Okay, and I like this pocket better than the Thor Rise because you have windows there. You have windows when you cover, when you close the door, and you got windows there. So you got four windows for great cross ventilation, and I love the floor layout. Okay, here's your sink, refrigerator, two burner propane gas stove. There is your sink. Okay, it doesn't have a microwave, but it has room to put a microwave if you want to put one in in these uh, storage bins and then use it when you're ready. This bed here folds up just like this, and there's a buckle. And then you can use this bottom area storage. So it's a, the smallest uh, class B on the market, usually the cheapest, and it's only 18 feet long. I wanted to show you the chassis. Now the chassis is still sitting on the 2022 older steering wheel. And that's why this is so cheap. The newer 2023 with the brand new chassis and steering wheel would probably be another 10 or 15 grand more. So these old steering wheels now are obsolete. The new ones are more sleek. I've shown them in some of my other videos. But that's why you're getting such a good price on this. Solus pocket. This would be one of my top picks for a single person that wanted to live on the road. But you know, seventy thousand, even though that's cheap, still a lot of money. Okay, and you know, you're not stealth anymore. It's definitely an RV, so something to consider. Hopefully, you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one.